Apple has officially launched the iPad Pro. 10 minutes ago, I was browsing on my smartphone and all of a sudden, Apple just launched this iPad. So I cannot resist and I wanted to cover this news as soon as possible. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to be discussing regarding the newly released iPad Pro and also the iPhone 9 is coming in couple of days. Tomorrow or day after tomorrow, the iPhone 9 is going to be officially launched by Apple. So guys, if you want to stay updated regarding this smartphone then definitely consider subscribing to our channel and without any further ado let's get started in 2018, Apple launched the iPad Pro with a newly designed body and overall with a great processing power. In 2020, even this iPad is performing like a champion. Well guys, 10 minutes ago, Apple has launched a brand new iPad and that is the iPad Pro 2020. So guys, this iPad is a very big upgrade than the older generation of iPad. Well guys, with this iPad, you are getting a newly designed camera setup. At the back, there are three cameras technically but amongst which two are real cameras whereas the third one is a sensor well guys the main camera of this ipad is of 12 megapixels nothing crazy with that but with this ipad you are getting a secondary camera which is a ultra wide angle lens the primary camera has a wide angle lens whereas the ultra wide angle camera is of 10 megapixels so you are getting one primary camera which is of 12 megapixels second is the ultra wide angle camera which is of 10 megapixel so guys the third camera sensor that you are getting in this ipad is the lidar well guys this sensor is used to sense or to accurately tell the data in the image it basically scans the depth and overall all of the distance of the object so guys this sensor will smartly adjust to the room it is a great revolution in terms of the AR department if you are using the measurement application if you are playing the AR games or or in general if you are more concerned about the augmented reality then this sensor will be a beast well guys this sensor captures all of the minute details in the depth of the particular thing so if you are taking photo of a table then this sensor can measure the depth of the table in short you can get the accurate length of this table and more precise AR experience so guys this camera believe me or not is going to be an incredible camera well guys you are getting a ultra wide angle camera you are getting a 12 megapixel primary camera and you are getting a LIDAR camera well guys this all camera setups makes this iPad a powerful beast so guys the camera in this iPad is the biggest highlight in terms of the changes well guys other than the camera you are having the latest processor by Apple the A13X chipset in this iPad is certainly one of the most fastest chipset on the planet not just in terms of a tablet or in terms of a computer in general the benchmark scores that you are going to be getting with this chipset is phenomenal so guys there is not a major difference in terms of the design but you are getting a new camera setup and the latest processor by Apple well guys this is the biggest change happening with this iPad and the price tag of this iPad is similar to that of the last years so guys in today's video I just wanted to give you the latest news regarding this iPad Apple has officially launched this iPad and tomorrow or day after tomorrow Apple is going to be launching the iPhone 9 and the iPhone 9 plus so guys if you want to stay updated regarding both of this iPhones then definitely consider subscribing to our channel and also I'm going to be coming with a complete review or the complete specifications video of this iPad well guys in today's video I just wanted to tell you everything in short and guys I'm going to be coming with lots of videos in the future so guys hope so you have liked this video and I will meet you with another beautiful video until then peace